Hi everyone and welcome to And So On. My name is Lisa and today I have a whole bunch of new free patterns for you. Okay, so it's been a really long time since I've done a free pattern video and I found so many lately I thought now is the time to share as everyone is gearing up for a new season and getting ready to sew. I'm calling this 20 plus plus free patterns for you because I'm also gonna show you other free patterns that are on those sites because most of the sites that I'm taking you to have other free patterns available and so I want you to, when you head over there, to look at the other ones that they have available as well. On top of that, I'm going to link to my Pinterest page where I collect these patterns so that you can go over there and look. There may be some I decided not to feature this time that you would love to see. There also may be some from like last year that you haven't seen yet, that kind of thing. So I want you to see exactly where I hold onto those free patterns while I'm waiting to do videos like these. If you like free patterns as much as I do, please do subscribe and like this video. It helps me so much. All right, it's time, let's have a look. So to start out, we have from Peekaboo Patterns, their adult classic sweatshirt. Comes in a great size range. So many great versions of this. I love all the different tester versions that they show. You know, you've got your pocket or you've got a hood or no hood. Really great pattern. And then you just go on and get on their mailing list, join their Facebook group, and you have access to a whole bunch more of these great patterns. So a really cute one to go by and have a look. Next on the Bernina website, we have this really pretty blouse tunic and you have both the instructions and pattern for the blouse, but also for the embroidery, which I think is really nice. Again, it's got a really good size range. All of the instructions are in English, so no worries there. And then on the Bernina site, they take you through as well, all the instructions. So you have both options. Very easy to download too, no sign up required. On Common Stitch, they have a new willow waist free dress pattern. This is really cute and they have a couple of other free patterns on their site as well. I like to go over and check the Instagram to see different versions and you can see that there. The Elemental Skirt from Sew House 7, I've made twice already. Really great pattern, different versions. Peggy's patterns are always so great if you haven't tried Sew House 7 before. Um, always worth trying and I they're my T and T's for sure so head over and grab that one on their newsletter. Schnitchen Patterns has a few zero waste. These I got through the fold line but you can also get it through their website. I thought this one was really cool and interesting. Um, just really interesting shape. Could be also be a kind of an interesting maybe maternity top or just a really neat design for summer that's a little bit different. Also a really good size range, really good instructions. They have another one on there as well. This is the number one dress and shirt. And so if you're interested in more sustainable sewing, this might be uh, an interesting couple of patterns to check out. On the Sew Magazine website, it's sewmag.com, I believe, or sewmag.co.uk, something like that. They have a ton of free patterns in all sorts of great sizes, all sorts of um, styles. You can click on garments and see the full sewing patterns. You can also click on downloads just to get templates and if you don't you know, need to worry so much about the instructions, but I absolutely love them. I noticed here they've got a new set of trousers, again, with a full um, set of instructions. Really, really great. Yeah, perfect instructions. Definitely head over there, there's a ton. Closet Core Patterns is a staple for me. They are so reliable, beautifully cut patterns always. Uh, amazing range of style as well as size range. Um, excellent instructions. This is a brand new free t-shirt pattern from them and I would absolutely head over and grab that. Dressmaking Amore is new to me but she has this really cute little flutter sleeve top. Don't know much about it but again, great size range. So Daily is also a magazine and every season they have really great free patterns. I'm loving this walkabout tunic. You can see here that when I click on that, I get this graphic and then when I kept, uh, click on the graphic, I get the full download. Um, pretty good size range here. Yeah, a very good size range actually from extra small to 7X. And they will have instructions in the magazine, so you might want to feel more comfortable sewing this on your own without instructions. But every season, they also have a sew along that you can sign up for for free. They have a free pattern magazine. If you're a new subscriber to their news list, you can get on that. 
and here's the sew along that I was telling you about. So that will be a full sew along that they're doing between February and May and you can access the pattern and the instructions for that. It's a video instruction sew along. So also another one that will be fun to pick up and every season I check back to this site. Peppermint Patterns is, or Peppermint Magazine, pardon me, is just a classic. I mean, they always have amazing patterns. The Bowen Dress is their newest for spring, for summer. Um, I absolutely love all of their patterns. You could make a whole wardrobe that would be very chic just using Peppermint Patterns. This is also a new one to me. This is the Anastasia. It's a free pattern. And I looked this up on Instagram and I'll show you some of the Instagram finds that I did later, but very pretty. Um, they have a full sew along on their YouTube site, but then at the same time, there's a free sew along as well on a friend's YouTube page that I'm going to link for you from Rachel from Stitched Up. And here you can see some of the different ones that have been made. Maison Fauve is another French company and they have this top here, the Tilda, which they're offering for free. I do find that French pattern companies tend to offer a smaller size range, not quite as inclusive, I'll be totally honest, but I still thought I should share. And here, if you go onto Instagram and put in Blues Tilda, you will find that, that design to have a look. Mood Society always has the best patterns. I wish that they showed them on people more. Sometimes I have a hard time really picturing what they'll look like just on a mannequin, but dozens of free patterns cut for all sizes. You can see here up to, from double zero up to a size 32, very, very inclusive, and a full set of instructions with photographs. Again, if you go on Instagram and you put in hashtag Mood Society, with a sew, you'll see um, all sorts of versions. Here's another one that I really like too, that I'm considering for myself, the Luna jumpsuit, which is a knit jumpsuit. And I think that would be really great, really great for spring, summer, maybe in a shorts version. Um, yeah, so they have such great patterns. Head over there. The Little Pomegranate is offering her very first free pattern, her very first pattern. And this is great for beginners. If you're brand new and you wanna be sort of hand holding all the way through, this is a perfect pattern for that, and I wanted to share it because I think that she's done a really lovely job creating this pattern, and I think it's perfect for the new sewist. When I first started to learn to sew, the Sorbetto top was one of the first free patterns I found, and uh, now they have reworked it. I think it was first in 2014, and they've reworked it. Um, also something that you can find on Instagram, all sorts of versions. I love that they've added sleeves, that they've had different lengths. Also, when you sign up for their newsletter, you will get the quince jacket here, not the class, but just the pattern. Uh, wow, so cool, so much you can do with that. Helen's Closet has the Sam apron, and I just thought that this is a this is apron is a cut above. Of course, you can find free apron patterns, but this has so many details. If you are a aspiring chef or if you have a workshop, something where you wear an apron a lot, I think that this one is amazing. And then she also has uh, a few other free patterns here. I always go to default low to high, and that allows me to see the free patterns. And here we have the tote and the Luna tank. Vicky Sews has a few free patterns. These are all on their English side. So if you see in the upper right-hand corner there, I've clicked English, then you're only gonna get English patterns. So not to worry on that count. This is sort of a trendy, slightly oversized sweatshirt. Um, again, if you go down to patterns and click free patterns, you'll see that they've got some new PJs for kids that are super cute, as well as a dress pattern that they brought out last year, the Milana, that's also been very popular. Now we have the McCall's dress. This is free on Minerva. It's easy, you just sign up for their website and they have um, a, this pattern that you can download from McCall's, so many versions. I went on Instagram and just put in hashtag M7969. You can do that for any McCall's pattern, just put M and the number and you can see and so much inspiration here. Absolutely beautiful. And then lastly, we have this one from Atelier Charlotte Ozu. Um, this one you can request in English when you, when you download it and she'll give it to you in English. I love that this again is about sustainable sewing. You are able to customize this and she gives you different ideas. I love that one there in the middle with the sort of, yeah, the triangle sort of chevron-y look. 
Um, and then again, she takes you through how to do it. I like to translate this into English just by using my browser, English Translate, but again, it's pretty straightforward. I think if you have a, a basic amount of sewing knowledge, this is pretty straightforward. All right, that's the last one. I hope you enjoy. Okay, that's it. Please let me know below if you've seen all of these before, if any of them are new to you, which ones you're dying to get and start sewing with. I would love to hear you know, what you think of these patterns. As well, just remember that it's a nice thing to do that if you download a free pattern to maybe go over to that person's Instagram, give them a like and a follow to thank them for the pattern. Okay guys, that's all for me. I hope that wherever you are, the sun is shining and you're sewing and I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.